Okay guys, we got a walkout basement scenario here. We can come in right over here on the side, the gates on the side of the house, uh, where you can get in. You got uh, good space here, a couple things maybe to clear out of the way. You can get the equipment in through this way. Uh, you got your electric panel right here. Uh, it's a Siemens panel. Uh, we got 200 amp service. Looks like the AC is a double pole 40 currently on this one. And I got a little bit of space if needed. The unit itself is right over here. Um, we're going to, looks like as far as space, we're a little tight here. So on the return drop, we've got room. We can scoot that over to the right and then plug that up and then run that down open up the space put the five inch filter uh, cabinet in there uh, as far as the flue currently this one has a five inch but it's a five inch that goes up two uh, three five and six inch this is all new so really all we need to do is just reconnect right here so um, We'll hook onto that, and that's a five inch connection there. You may have to adapt up to it if you have a four inch flue. Um, gas line doesn't look too bad, and it's had work done on it, so it's fairly new down all in here. I think we can get by with just reconnecting right here into the unit itself. Condensation line coming down is about, uh, about two feet, two and a half feet from the unit itself. Uh, you can see as far as the plenum, it actually tapers down up into the ductwork. Up there, there you go, you can see it. This unit currently also has a humidifier on it. Uh, I'll talk to the customer and see if he's still interested in having that. Here it is right here, because that definitely needs to be gone. But the feed line is I was looking for the feed line. Oh here you go. It's connected right here to the, by the water heater with a connection, so that would have to be replaced. Um here's the back of the unit. A little tight, you got the water heater sitting right next to it as well.